Hello, this is Steve at HydrogenForHealth.com. Today I want to do a demonstration on two different types of bottles and show you what the parts per million of hydrogen content is in the water after they've charged the water. Right here what we have is a straight electrolysis bottle. This is a very common bottle on the market probably about 97 percent of the bottles on the market use this straight electrolysis technology this is a bottle that uses SPE technology or PEM technology uh, very few bottles on the market use this technology and I want to show you the difference in the technologies this one here is a uh, really common technology and what it does is it puts the hydrogen and the oxygen into the water this one here puts only hydrogen into the water the oxygen is exhausted out the bottom of the bottle now I want to show you the differences in ppm on both of the bottles what I've done is I filled both of the bottles with distilled water I'm going to go ahead and run them this one has a 7 minute setting and this one has a 10 minute setting so I'm going to run this one for 7 minutes and this one for 10 minutes we're going to test the hydrogen content with this meter this is a ENH 1000 this is a Japanese meter it's very accurate we're going to test the content with this meter so I'm going to go ahead and let these go and I'm going to edit the video for length so when we come back both of these will be, uh, be done. Let me give you a close up of the uh, hydrogen being produced. Okay, we'll be right back. All right, as you can see, the indicator light is just turned off on the SPE bottle. We should have a few more minutes on this bottle. We'll let this one run three minutes longer, and we'll go ahead and take a take a sample and see. Uh, what the hydrogen content is. While this one's still running, I'm going to go ahead and test the hydrogen content on the SPE bottle. Alright, turn it on. Well, you can see that. You can zoom in. Yeah, you should be able to see that. 1.52 ppm. 1525 ppb. That's on the higher end. Normally this bottle will be between 1 and 1.4 ppm. 1 1.5 is great to see. Okay, the other bottle is about done. We'll wait for it and we'll test the other bottle. All right, the other bottle is now completed. We'll go ahead and take the top off of it and give it a give it a test. Turn the meter on.
It's pretty good for this bottle. Not normally this high, but we did run it another three minutes. So we've got point seven it's going down. We'll say point seven five ppm. Seven hundred and There we go. We'll just say 790 ppb. You can see there's a dramatic difference in the amount of hydrogen that is in the water. And that's the difference between the SPE technology and the straight electrolysis technology. We do carry both these bottles on our website. Uh, you can see them at hydrogen4health.com. That's hydrogen, the number four, health.com. This concludes this video. Thanks for watching.